Hey guys, hope you're having a great day today. All right, it is Friday in my household, Friday in your household. Are you happy the holidays are over? You can like breathe now. I feel like everything is just out of sync and I'm trying to get into a routine. Our life has changed here in the last few weeks and so I'm just like, how am I gonna make this all work? So I am working on making it happen. I still wanna get videos out to you each and every day. So it's just a matter of how those videos are going to look. And so I know towards the end of 2019, I started just doing daily, um, like what I'm doing on Monday, what my Tuesday looks like, what my Wednesday looks like. And sometimes it changes and things that we do. And so for now, I was thinking about like my goals for my channel this year, things like that that I want to, do and so the point of doing this YouTube channel is to share with you the things that I've learned in my household to make my life easier, to encourage you in your life, to encourage you in your spiritual life, in your emotional life, and just in your physical life as well. It's like I want you to be best that you can be in your situation in your life. And so this past week, you know, I saw I filmed a couple different videos. You saw my left stuff more life and my homemaking videos. And I hope you enjoyed them. Those are a little bit shorter and I'm hoping that my well, mom was a little bit longer, but I'm hoping to still share three days a week of a whole day of what I do because three days a week I do have full days of things that we're doing and you know like today we're gonna go shopping. You're gonna have a shopping and a little bit of a food monthly food prep that I'm gonna be doing as well. But I don't do like those things every day. And this year I'm having Lauren two full days a week. So those two full days a week, I'm like, wait a minute. It's like, I'm just gonna be working at my computer. It's my day to catch up on things. I did have her at the end of the year, like half days. And that was good for me doing my errands and my running, but I still had to come home and I still had to edit videos and I still had to work and do things. And I'm like, the point to have someone help you is to lessen your burden. And I did the running, but I like to keep my work on those days so that I can still be mom and I can still like be in the moment and do things at home. And so I'm gonna try to get into this new schedule this year. We've had lots of changes. Greg is now home full time, which is awesome. So he is, his, his focus is the shop, which is really good. So it's just adjustment. Cause like today he's gonna go shopping with me. So it'll be shopping with the husband again. <laughs> So things like that. So I'm just trying to like, okay, like yesterday I didn't film at all a day and I was like, oh, and we didn't, we are not doing school. We're still on vacation. We'll start on Monday, but I'm like, okay. I'm like, I took a nap on the couch and I felt I'm like, wow, if I'm not filming, I feel like I'm just sitting here not doing anything. So I need to reprogram my thinking in my life, what I'm doing and go, okay, this is what I'm going to do today. So it's going to be a little bit of adjusting for me, not for you guys. You guys still watch videos every day. But I want to try to bring something to you, something physical that you can do for your life. And that's why I did the less stuff, more life, because I want you to help cut down on things in your life so that you can experience a great abundant life. And then the homemaking series one, I don't know if I'm going to keep it called homemaking. I feel like that's a good word, but maybe there's a better word. I don't know. But I feel like that's going to be something we can do together, going through our entire house, weeding out, cutting out things that we don't need, you know, kind of getting our house so that at the end of the year, we can be like, wow, look at how much better our homes are. And so... Hopefully you enjoy those videos and the reason, like I said, I cut those out is because those two days a week, I'm not gonna be doing anything. So I'm just like, this will be good because I'm gonna be sitting at my laptop and getting a lot of my work done, editing these videos. I have a new laptop and it gets done, things done faster. So usually I can do one a day. And by the time I start exporting it because it's so full of like gigabytes and bigness, it takes like all night to export. So now I can do, like I over the holidays here, I've done two and three in one day. That's how quick it is. So I'm excited. So like I've already filmed one, it's on my little can SD card, and then this video will be on this card, and I won't have to work on this card until, I mean, I might do it today because my work but like next week is when I can do it. And so that's gonna help lessen the workload for me so that I'm not just working all the time. Does that make sense? Because my first thing is a stay-at-home mom, and this YouTube has been awesome. It's opened up an avenue of income for our family, bringing my husband home, which is awesome, so that he can focus on um, his dream, which is the shop, and for our family, things like that. But I don't want to get into like just work mode and mommy mode and everything else, because I don't want to lose that. You know what I mean? Like That's my first thing in life. My first is Jesus, my second is my home, and being a mom. And working is, is there and that's awesome and God has given me the ability and the grace to do what I do. And now I'm like, okay, now I get a little bit of a, a little break and then I can still do that and really focus on that and not have to do so much of the work, which is gonna be really good because I still like to do videos. I still feel like that's what God wants me to do each and every day. So this is just getting to the point of how I can manage and make it work, which I will and God will help me and I'm excited for that. 
So, but today is like, okay, full camera day. So I'll come out here and talk and share. Hopefully you guys had a fantastic new year. Even if last year was a bad year, guess what? This is a whole new year, a whole new opportunity to make things good, right? That's why we're doing the Less Step More Life. We're gonna focus on those things so that you can help better your life. The homemaking, I wanna help you physically get your homes in order so that you can enjoy your home and make it a place that you can come to and enjoy and your husband enjoys coming home, your kids enjoy coming to and that you enjoy sitting in. So you're not always having to go away because you can't stand being in your home, right? So today for us, what I'm gonna do today is we are gonna get shopping done. So I went on, actually the beginning of this week because I was way ahead, um, and ordered most of my groceries from Walmart. So I'm gonna go pick those up today. I'm picking up Autumn's vlogger doll set that she wanted for Christmas. It was late and late and finally it's in. So I'm gonna go pick that up. And then we're gonna go hit the discount store to go look for a few, just the discount store in our town, not the huge one. I'm, I'm not gonna do the South Carolina one because I have so much in my pantry and freezer right now. This is gonna be the lean month and the leaner groceries, not a bad way, a good way. We're cutting out a lot of the junk. I still have a lot of the junk here at home, so I'm not gonna buy a lot more, but we're gonna keep it simple with meals, and I'm gonna do not huge monthly food preps. I'm gonna cook like my meat today, which is not a whole lot. It's gonna be a very simple food prep for the month, but I'm gonna show you some things that you can do, but I'm basically gonna be on Mondays, which I'll share with you, um, getting my food ready for the week. I hope that helps and that might be a little bit more tangible way for you that I want to do freezer meals things like that so I mean I'll still do freezer meals just in January this is what I'm gonna focus on is do I'll probably be cooking my meats I know that's what I'll be doing today later when I get back do the grocery haul and then I'll do prepare my meats and get them in the freezer so that come Monday that's one of the things I'll do is okay what do we have in Monday through Saturday and then getting my foods ready in the refrigerator so that we can have an easy meal prep for the week and then that'll hopefully encourage you and help you get your weeks ready because it's easy to watch these videos with freezer prep and there's so much to do and it's like what do you even start okay so let's just start for, with the week and we'll go through the week and then you know what maybe february we'll do some freezer meals and we'll work our way up because that's what we're gonna do we're gonna do practical tangible advice to help you in your home so all right so i got up did my computer work you saw i got my hair I'm using my new blow dryer thing okay so <laughs> people are like do a tutorial i don't even know what i'm doing right now so <laughs> i used it the first day and then i felt like my hair was real puffy and i still got out my straightener and used that later on so then last night i woke up i don't even know i took a nap yesterday that was a mistake i took like a 20 minute nap because i was tired which is great to take a nap but it did not do me good for last night because 2 30 i was awake and i was like Oh my goodness so i started watching youtube videos <laughs> so so i love how youtube suggests ones that i normally wouldn't watch i started watching ones that i had there was one with the hair dryer so i watched it and i was like oh that's how you use it because i would have no way idea of using these things and so i'm like okay so today i was like okay i felt like that was a little bit better so i do like it it'll just be keeping my hair down and using it um daily but like it love it learning to like it. it's one of those things um it did take way less time than blow drying and straightening my hair gives it a little bit more volume and is all good so i'm like okay that was a good way and then um then i just started watching other videos and then it shows like a whole bunch on there and i just kept going through them and watching ones i normally don't watch it's it's amazing how social media will suck you in i'm not much of a suck you in person i don't do social media anything except face or not facebook youtube um i do my blog but i don't go on there and post all the time but what I just kept watching is all these videos and a lot of people were dealing with depression and like the aftermath after Christmas and I get all that I get that that's all a real thing and I just thought how much of how many of us are living with the the repercussions of spending for Christmas the repercussions of like all the highs and excitement now it's like a low I want to keep that going that positiveness all year round you know just because it's a new year doesn't mean need to be a new you you should start making changes in your life i'm starting this new year out by helping you make changes but we're going to do it the entire year you know that's what i want you to do is continue it so that it's not like okay i'm just going to start now so that i feel like everybody else no i want you to make it a part of your lifestyle when you're going through things in life it's like i want to encourage you to change your life spiritually so that you can have that peace in your heart no matter what i don't want you to have those highs and lows of things i want you to always have that high we can go through those lows but i still want your your mindset and your heart to be like okay know where I'm at I'm content I'm with God he is gonna keep me and I don't need to worry about going down but it's it's not so much watching like you can watch a lot of these videos and these YouTube videos and mine as well and you can go wow she has she does this all in my day she does all these things that I just can't barely stay awake with my kids and I'm like we're at different places in life we're at different ways different situations different 
home, you know, ways that everything's set up, you got to do you. You got to do you and where God has you and where the grace that God will give to you is different than the grace he gives to me. Not that he doesn't give you, but we have different situations. Sometimes when you watch these videos and you're like, oh my goodness, I just want this. And, I, and you get that like idolizing of what you think life should be. And it's not, that's not how life is for you. My life's different than your life. And so that's why I want to go through and share different videos this year just to like help you specifically in your home. I'll still share my life and what we do because it is still can help. It can still like show like, look at this is what I do. I cook and clean and you know, go shopping for a bunch of people. I try to find deals. I do those things. But the ultimate goal is to say, not for you to look at it and go, oh, that's the life I want. No, I want you to say, I want you to see the contentment and the peace and the joy in me and my life. And the only reason I have that is because of my relationship with the Lord. And so he gives me the grace to do what I do. It's not because my life has been handed to me on a silver platter. Far from it. <laughs> I've had to work at it. I've had to work on my marriage. I've had to, I keep working with my relationships with my kids and my husband. I've had to work at my home. I've had to do all these things. And so I want to share more of that with you guys to help you in your life. So that's what we're going to do this year. You're right. More about making that tangible, like what can I physically do? Not just a one video of a top 10 ways to save or top 10 things to do to make your life easier or how to get out of that rut. No, I want you to learn to live that right lifestyle of how to feel like motivated every single day. I don't want you just to watch those videos, those top 10 videos, top five videos, and then live it for, yeah, 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 keep it going, and then two weeks later you're back down. No, I want you to learn a way of life that you can live successful every single day. That's what my hope and prayer is for this channel. I want you to live life to the fullest every day of your life. No regrets, no after Christmas downs and lows, no like just feeling great high and then down low in another couple weeks. No, we want to feel great all the time because the Lord Jesus is living inside of us and he's directing us every single day. Things are happening. We're getting right opportunities. We're getting right positive results in our home because we're doing what we're supposed to do. So that's our goal. That's what we're going to be doing. So today my goal is to go shopping. So we're going to do that. I'm going to get out the door. I'm not going to do a lot of stuff in the house. There's not a whole lot to clean up. It's been staying clean and good since the holidays. Everybody's been doing good. Keep it up on their things. So we're going to have an easy day. I'm going to leave Lauren with the kids and Greg and I are going to go shopping. So next clip you'll see, we'll be in the car and we're going to go hit our shopping discount store with Greg. We'll see how much stuff we come home with. <laughs> no, he knows budget. We got to stick on the budget. Now these home, I'm like, okay, honey, you got to stick to the budget. This is what we have. This is what we're doing. And all learning. So you guys ready for some shopping today? And then I'll come home to your grocery haul and then I'll show you food prep. It's going to be a full long video. Thank you guys for always watching and for your continued support for my channel. And let's get going. Let's go. All right. Minute to the car. Oh, I'm not ready. He's ready. He's like, honey, we're recording. I'm like, yes, totally it's working ready. day. Today is filming with Greg. Hi. Whole new life, Greg. Oh, look at what are we doing? We're Greg's doing, doing thing again. grocery hauls with Amy. So the but he has a new twist. It's called Stay Within Budget. Not like oh. the last shopping haul where we spent so much money at <laughs> no, that one store. It's it's it was Christmas. It was Christmas. You gotta have fun. It's right. So now it's serious shopping. You gotta so gain 15 pounds. No or life more. Would be right. I don't think so. So we are headed to the grocery outlet here. I'm gonna film inside a little bit because I have Greg. Oh yeah. And he has my back so we're gonna go in here see so we can finally get my list oh, i get to be camera operator today no, no, i'll be camera you gonna be camera operator? i'll totally operate i think you do that mm -hmm. okay we'll see how he does okay <laughs> because right. we're gonna go in here we're gonna look for their meat i like their meat here they have really good meat because they have a butcher right here so i mm. we'll see if they have get some good meat and see what other kind of deals we is his name here. sam no sam the butcher honey <laughs> brady yeah. little brady bunch reference you for you oh brady can bunch. i say that you can, honey. Copyright? I probably just got you banned. Sorry, I'm speaking. Flagged, honey. Okay, we're gonna go in because it's starting to rain. Right. Let's go in. Is this wrecking me? I'm recording you, baby? Let, let's get this delicious purse. Oh my goodness. It looks like so nice in the in the light. It looks like something that you could pick off and eat. Honey. It's really pretty color. Don't I still get to have uh, cart duties, though? Oh, for sure. You need your hands free, baby. weird <laughs> you can't take me anywhere can you <laughs> okay so just be quiet then oh honey you're passing up yummy cheese mango habanero gouda dang what is this kind what do we got here I don't even know what that is, but it looks yummy. 
Mm. And this is after I ate it too. I stopped at McDonald's and got a biscuit. Oh yeah, make the border fajitas, baby, with pineapple and uh, what's that cheese? The greatest cheese in the world, what is it? What's it called? Queso. queso. Sorry, I don't know. Queso cheese is like the new favorite thing. I just, I'm like literally almost, almost 50 years old and I've just now discovered queso cheese. I feel like an infant trapped in an adult body. <laughs> I know, but look at what I got though. Danger. Look at what I found. What? Use the spoke. What? I'll turn you. You stick. Use the Um, I think you don't get the whole thing. You can pause it so you can play your battery. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. <laughs> look at this. Well. You're like an alien. You're not Such even from alien. here. Okay, look so at beautiful. That, so embarrassing. So what's going on right now, babe? Don't need these, but you can access what? The taquito. Taquito. No, 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 no. Be truthful. Every, all the stuff that I wanted, she's like, come on, dummy. Money. Don't get that. Save money. She, yep, she grabbed my arm and pulled I'll me away. You know why? We'll birthdays. I'll see? No, it's, everybody loves taquitos. Everybody. Literally, the whole house loves them, thanks. Especially when she puts them in the air fryer. Mm, so yummy. Okay, so that's $4. Yeah, that's not bad. $3.99. Bam. All right, to the car. Okay, store number one done. So I th we spent, I was have to say what I spent, people mm -hmm. like that, it was $72 there. You'll have to forget, she's, she's teaching me all this. This is all new oh, stuff I'm learning here. I'm feeling out of whack. I'm like, what, Greg's filming? What, I have to I talk know. to you in the store? No, I can't run a mile ahead of you. you no, you totally can. <laughs> Today's relaxing, see how relaxed I am, yeah. honey? Look, I'm holding your oh, arm. Oh, I love it. I don't have to hurry, because it's not Christmas, and there's and, not 10,000 people yeah, everywhere, because Christmas, there was so many people. I mean, you don't have to, if you want to, you know, if you just want to like blow through there. And, and run through, you'll, you'll appreciate I won't, that. I won't say one single word on the camera. I don't want to ruin everything. There's no ruin. Just get the cover up, it's raining. <laughs> Yeah, so we got we didn't get tons of stuff there. Okay, come stand under. But we did get, get um, um so the meat I'm gonna put in here. Yeah. Um, not tons of stuff, but still got some stuff. So we're showing me to get home. So I, the total here was 72. So for those of you that like the price, when we get home, I'll show you what we got. All right, successful trip store number one. Not bad. Yeah. So whatever. You don't have to go there, but they do. They have some well, stuff. Well, thankfully so. it wasn't raining on us. It's not bad. So now we're going to go over to Aldi and go see what they have. Mm. Or we know what they have. Just go get the stuff we need there. Mm. There's no surprises. Yuck. Okay, fine. Greg said how stupid he was. No, I'm never, oh, yeah. Greg puts the quarters in Ooh, the, slot, the slot over here, Z4. and he puts it like in the second one. So like he goes to pull the cart and it wouldn't pull out. Like, huh? <laughs> but we did help a little lady got her own cart. So, all right, we're gonna go into Aldi here and go get. We just have a few, mostly veggies and fruit here. So let's go see what they got. No, honey, it's 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 zero waste store. Okay, I didn't know. <laughs> no bags, no nothing. Look, I should be putting them in a bag. I know, honey, it's no waste. Uh, no, okay. no, it wastes. It includes the environment. Well, did you see the plastic. They, they just passed a uh, law. Oh, I don't. I don't the, think we went around the U.S. in a few places for yeah. uh, out, out long plastic bags. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Some places do. Yeah. Right. Can't 
canceled all my plans to be with you tonight, tonight. So just sit with me, talking to the night and to the morning, building chemistry. I don't think I ever wanna go come closer next to me. Trying to find another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. You make me anxious. I think I might be stuck on you. I love the things you did, you did for me. For me, it seems like you're dropping clues. There's no need to rush, so let's just take our time. Dropping everything, cause you're stuck on my mind. My mind. So just sit with me, talking to the night and to the morning, building chemistry. I don't think I ever wanna go come closer next. Trying to find another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. Oh. I picked up the parrot planner. I really like Lauren's, and I gave mine to Jaden. Lauren took it, so I'm thinking this one for me. You're one more. I think I would like that. I need a nice big one. Oh my gosh, you were the first one okay. I would use that. Not bad for Aldi. Good nope. job, baby. Doing good. We're doing great. It's starting to happen. It's raining. While we're in but the what store. is it not doing? Um, what are we thankful for, honey? I'm thankful for you. For no, sure. we're thankful for no snow. Oh yeah. Oh snow. Yeah. It's just raining. So I, I for, try to forget about snow. Actually, I'm gonna go over there. So so much easier. That's what I, I said. Go. Northeast. They said that it was. Uh, Look at you putting the groceries away. Northeast is supposed to get a <laughs> big old snowstorm. Oh yeah. They're saying a foot of snow overnight. So, so I crazy. Hope they don't. He did good. All right, so in, what are we spending there, 85? Ooh, your planner's getting wet. Uh, uh, so I got a new planner, I'm excited. I wasn't gonna get one, but then I, I, I'm like, you know what, I need them. They were there's like $7. So this is the parent planner one. So just had like household management. I have one at home, but it's small. And I was writing it today, I'm like, oh my goodness. It, and I put like 10,000 sticky notes in mine to make space, so this would be nice not to have to. So that's a good thing, planners are always fun. So we spent, I think, 85 in there? Yeah. 85, again, some things, I was, they were out like, at carrots, they had no carrots, which is weird. That's a weird like, thing who has no of. They had like the organic ones, but not regular ones, but we did get stuff, so. We're just gonna keep getting groceries here. And now we're going slow, we're on slow time, because the groceries aren't ready till noon, so we're gonna go over to Sam's Club next and go see, get a few things in there, and then we'll head to Walmart. You're doing fantastic, honey. Look at. Huh? My own personal shopper. Oh yeah. I don't know how to shop. I've yeah. never done it. I, he's good. He's like, honey, like we're gonna get back. The kids are, Lauren has the kids all day today. Let me keep talking. And so she's, I'm like, and I don't really have dinner. Wait, time out. Can I interrupt? I'm yeah. sorry. I'm sorry. You can do that. What are these for? Um, anything. Like, can yeah. I put all this fruit in there? Go you, honey. Yeah, some people bring their own grocery bags. I just throw everything in the car. Okay. I didn't know. We could bring our own bags, honey. Again, I, I don't See, do he's here so he can do that. I just feel like that's more, like for me, I don't want to load it up when I'm sitting outside oh, with my yeah. bags, but you can. Um, Okay, so what are we doing? So, the, oh, I'm getting so Okay, so like Lauren tonight, she has the kids all day, so I'm like, I want to give her an easy dinner because I don't really want to do food prep and not really have dinner tonight. So, she's like mac macaroni and cheese in a box and chicken tenders. So we got some chicken tenders here mm -hmm. and like a honey or no, what was the one honey batter or something? One. It looks almost like a fish fillet, like the fish. It looks like it's deep, more yeah, deep you fried. deep fried. So that'll be. And then they didn't have macaroni, so he was. He's like, but honey, they have. Yes. He's like, but honey. Yeah, that's fine. He's like, but honey, they have the shell cut. I'm like, yes, at a dollar eighty a box. He said times three. I said versus thirty three cents. See how you save yourself three bucks. So he's gonna become the frugal shopper. Yeah, I just don't. I have no. And Greg idea. might even become the food maker. Oh, I would love. I'd love to do that. Meal maker one of these it's days. Gonna, it's basically gonna be P.F. Chang's Chinese every, every day. <laughs> and we're gonna go to P.F. Chang's and then bring it home. That'll be good. And that'll be good. So okay, we're gonna go ahead. Corn rain. We're gonna go to Sam's Club. Thank you. Come here, baby. In Sam's Club, we made it. 
We were, we're going to do the chicken tenders. They were two seventy eight a pound. I'm like, you know what? I'll just get this. Is it? They have dollar sixty eight. Usually it's a dollar ninety nine. So this is actually a really good That's deal. That's a good deal. You know, you didn't have daddy cut it. That's right. I like that they have ground chicken. I got it. Get it on. It's on you. Okay, come on, honey. <laughs> right here, baby. Wait, but you miss you miss something right here. <laughs> you crazy fool, you. You think you're so funny. Okay, I think these will be yucky. All right, baby, let's go find some. What, what, what are you leading me to, though? There. It's... Okay, so how was your shopping experience? Hi, now we are brown. So far, it's You've been, been very eye-opening. We've been blue the whole time. I'm sorry, I had my color scheme off. That's probably some of my fat fingers. Oh, actually, come down here. You can okay. probably get a big thing of pickles for cheap. Yeah, but it's going good. I feel like I'm learning all kinds of good stuff. Yes, I'm like, honey, no, expensive. Only taquitos, those are in Sam. Just kidding. Cereal, see expensive cereal is. Oh, is it? Uh-huh, that box will be gone in a day. But it's, you know what else it is? It's, it's delicious. And it's all sugar. So we're doing good. We're doing good and healthy. Sam's come just got a little bit. <laughs> Golden Pops and Cocoa Pops. Yeah, Ooh, you know what? You get me in the Captain Crunch spot. Oh, he's forget gone. Forget it. it. Start drinking this. We're going to go ahead down here and see what they got. Because sometimes they have a huge jar of pickles for cheap. Sometimes. We're just going to see the price uh, on no, things. I grew so. up eating a lot of this right here. That's right. Quaker oatmeal. Quaker oatmeal. And that's what we're going for, baby. Yeah. We're having it. It's getting home. up in them Michigan, freezing cold Michigan that's winters. That's right. Get a belly full of that. Well, we're going to have that here with the warm weathers. Okay. We're going to go turn the corner look for cheese. Oh, they got stuff. I'd never buy this, but this is a really good price. It's six bucks. You get six packs, so it's a dollar a pack, and it's like got wheat bulgur and like, that's some good stuff, baby. Let's get where's wheat bulgur. Remember we said bulgur burger. We used to mix it with our meat. Well, what is it though? It's a uh, it's a know? grain. So that's actually that'll be like like Lauren and I would eat that, and the girls will. Yeah, it looks like something you girls. Would that's like. a good deal. look. At even this clearance cool, stuffing. Six pouches. Six pouches. That's what I'm thinking. That's like a dollar a pouch, and this right here is cheap too if you need stuffing, but Dang, we don't. That sounds really good. Actually. Look at it. this stuffing four dollars, but we already have some, so that's cheap. That's only fifty cents a box. Grab it. I already got some. Okay. Let's see if we see any more deals. Okay, this is this is Juanita. Your yellow beans and rice. Look at it. it's only two seventy one. That is a deal. Okay, we need two of those. Who's that's Juanita? cheap. Well, one of my YouTubers gave me a. Recipe tip. and it's the greatest rice ever. Just one or two. I'll get two because that's okay. really cheap. Thank you to Juanita then. Huh? Thank you, Juanita, for a clearance price. That's such. Greg's like, should we do the umbrella or not? I'm like, no, let's just walk in the rain, honey. Why do we bring the umbrella? I know, and then I stop and I'm like, no, really. You want it's to do umbrella. The... It's all good. You want to get the umbrella out? No, it's under all the groceries, honey. <laughs> Prepared for that. That's okay. We're learning shopping. I should have had shopping. the umbrella at the ready. So we did good. We got some clearance stuff here, so we spent yeah. ninety here. So we're actually doing good. My Walmart is going to be one. 70s my total at Walmart. So okay, we're like one, two, we're like four hundred dollars. That's about four hundred dollars yeah. for groceries. Well, and I'm starting to understand the flow and how you think. Yes. How I think. Yep, Scary. I'm starting to get inside. Don't of, get in my brain, inside baby. Inside of your brain. It's Don't very, do it. It's very fast paced. It's very fast paced. You saw Greg run in the store. I'm like, oh. honey, come back. I'm slow moving today. It's like an actual. Well, I don't. Yeah, I have to do. Day. It's no hurry today. It's rainy. It's a different cash. story when I got to be home by half a day for Lauren. Oh yeah. Then I got all day with Lauren. 
It's worth paying her all day. I totally understand. So, okay, I'm gonna help a grocery then. Okay, so now we're done with Sam's Club. We're gonna head over to Walmart. I ordered everything online, but the only thing I could not order online was Wong Tong wrappers. I have no idea why. They have them in the store. Don't know why they're not in the grocery pickup. So Walmart, add Wong Tong wrappers. So I'm gonna go grab those, and then I'm gonna go pick up Autumn's Blogger Dell set is there as well. And then Madeline wants a pop socket for her um, tablet, because she doesn't wanna use a case. And then we need box macaroni and cheese, toilet paper for the shop. And that's it. So we're gonna go there right now, like right now. Oh, and uh, don't let me. <laughs> like right now, honey. I know. He's on his tab, and I'm second, like, dude. you can sit when we're after we're done. Um, While we're doing grocery pickup, we'll be sitting for like 20 minutes. Don't let me forget to look at the Keurig things there. Okay, there you go. Okay, so we're gonna go over there now. Two years old. Cracking it. Honey, pick, we're supposed to enter that one. <gasps> it doesn't change the facts when you open it. This is the thing they don't have. Long time wrappers. Okay, and we did grab halos and carrots. Okay, let's go get. Long time wraps. I never would have imagined those would be right here. Right here. Because we're a box macaroni and cheese and tons of three. There you go, baby. Lunch. Three is a weird number. We need to get four. Three is a good number. That's all we need. We don't eat four. Then I'll three be extra. Is not a good number. Okay, grab six pack. It's like not divisible by anything. Okay, grab six pack. Six pack macaroni. Yeah. Look at that. Like artesian crafted. They got all fancy macaroni and cheese now. Oh, can I get it? No. Oh, the deluxe. Deluxe. Such yeah. cheddar. We're unhealthy, honey. The oranges are for us. Okay. Alright. Oh my goodness, what is this? We're doing this? something here. This is Walmart. This is the store. Wow, this is crazy fun. Oh my goodness. I, I feel like so far behind in the times, baby. Right here. Right here. And here. What? What? You just put your phone in there and it read it. Oh my god. Oh, look at this. The product comes sliding down an elevator and is delivered is to Bunsy. Gift that she's been wanting and we look for it everywhere. Wow. So Sure oh my goodness, she's so excited. You'll have to send her a text when we get in the car for sure. Let's just make sure. Just in case. That's kind of cool. That is way cool. Oh, That's crazy. Someone's <laughs> stocking that thing every night. Oh, yeah. Blogger. Oh, yeah. Blogger, blogger down accessories. This is what we waited for. In hand. Let's get a little peek on what did you get there, Mama? You're there. the worst package opener ever. Look at that. That's all Autumn wanted. Blogger playset. Wow. Oh my goodness. She is going to be just That's like mom. so fun. Oh my goodness. So happy. Okay, we take pictures. Look at She's got the laptop going. It's so fun. Little tripod. So Selfie nice. sticks. Hilarious. I can't believe that was so cool. And this was literally like one of the most, like, I couldn't find most uh, valued prizes for this Christmas season. For I couldn't find them. They were like sold out everywhere. So. Well, that's really great. <sighs> All right, baby. Let's go do grocery pickup. Okay. Now. You know what? You are beautiful. Did you know that? You are too. I didn't know if you knew it or not. Let's go, okay. Sorry. Sorry. All right. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Okay. Do I make it close now? Yeah. They might scare me. I'm going out here. Okay. Honey, we're doing great. Look at us. Get the umbrella up here. We're doing good. Thank goodness. Yeah. We only got one more thing to do. Cloudy. Go pick up the groceries. Cloudy day today. That's a good day to do grocery pickup. Yeah, this is right here for this. It's not like we could be up at the top of Chimney Rock right Honey, now. Honey, it's raining right now. Away. Who's going to eat later on? Oh, you're going to need food. You're going to need food. Oh, we're over here to the left. One more over? One more over. Thank you, baby. Sorry. All right, we're doing the Walmart pickup now, so we're just waiting for the person to come out, and then we're going to be good. We're going to kind of run back in the store, so I'm in the driver's seat. Okay, so the only thing they did not have were those tiny little um, mini croutons. Remember I told you that my uh, the person from, remember the tiny croutons that I got from my package from Israel? So I found some awesome is the name, mini croutons, but they said they were here and they didn't have them. So I actually ordered those and then I ordered rice cakes and they substituted all of ours for chocolate. <laughs> It's okay, they'll get eaten. But I really wanted some plain ones because I'm eating those for breakfast. So I just went on Amazon and they've got them on Amazon, the Prime Pantry. So I'm hoping that they don't um, charge me like to have Prime Pantry because I have, it's like free shipping is taken off. So I'm gonna order it and see what happens. 
but and just check. So that was perfect. So now I'll get the rice cakes that come in a couple days. How cool is that? So substitute and just get your thing coming. So that's coming on the seventh. So that's good. Okay. I'm just looking what else. I'm not gonna ship it. Okay. So I'm gonna wait for my husband. Here we go. Here we are in the meal delivery zone. We're in the meal delivery zone. We're going to where are we at? Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A. So we've got a spicy soap up salad. You did. And fries and coke. So here it is. All right, then we're gonna go get some gas and then we're gonna go head home and show you everything we got. All right, so maybe fun. we made it shopping and Good job, learned baby. some things. You learned some great things. Yes, ma'am. Okay, we'll stop and get some gas and I totally went to eat my salad and they did not give me forks. So I'm just gonna have to wait till we get home. So Great day, good day shopping, get our stuff, head home, and it'll be good. Huh? All right, so we're home now. Let me show you all the stuff that we got. This is what I got from the Walmart pickup. So we got two gallons of milk. We already had a plenty of almond and plenty of coconut milk. This soda right here is all for our pelicans for the whole month, so we'll just split it up and use it for that. I got two curly noodles to do with the chopped meat, um, like beef tip type dinner. We got rice cakes. Okay, my goal was to get a bunch of these, but they substituted chocolate. So that's okay. We'll still eat them. I went on Amazon and bought the ones I needed. They were the same price to have them delivered. So then we got some apple cinnamon ones as well. So thing of cheddar cheese, two things of eggs. We got some halos and four corn chips for our chili. I love how the car smells like chocolate. Is there any other mess in there? Did you get my planner? Okay. And then we'll go right here. We got I got some cans of cream of chicken soup. Could have made it, but I'm gonna use it for recipe. So I got it. This um, they substituted vegetable oil. That's okay. Um, we got some soy sauce for Chinese. This is for dinner tonight. So they'll have boxed macaroni. I just got one thing of carrots just for cooking. We got some broccoli. Big thing of sour cream. They substituted for just the great value. Four ragu. And then I got whipping cream here for some soups. They, okay, so this, I did not pay attention. This is way small. I wanted three big bottles, so this is way too small. So that's okay. I was like, why is that the good price? So I, I'm gonna need more of those probably. Petite diced tomatoes, I got five cans of those. These are all corn for a lot of recipes. So I got a bunch of corn, some green chilies, the Wong Tong wrappers. They, you can't get those at the grocery pickup. You have to get those, on, or you have to go in and pick them up, which is weird. Black beans, I just got cans of them, even though we have dried just for recipes. These are sweet peas, because we like canned sweet peas for some reason, so there's a bunch there. Bow tie pasta for recipes. I don't know how to say this. Someone said it's not Celentani, it's like Celentani or something, so we got this for our pasta dish. Bread for the month. This is for dinner. Oh, wait, actually, this is all these. That's another store, hold on. Great Value Rice. Ice cream for our pelicans. We got one of these there. That was like $8. I was like, ugh. But I got it for the recipe. Okay, I got these all there after I went to the discount store and realized they were three for a dollar, but this will stay nice for a long time. These go till February. So we got those. This is gonna be Aldi. We got this for dinner tonight. The crispy chicken and then the batter one. Then we got some scooper chips here. I got this chicken sausage for soup, that good soup. Two things of bacon. And this, this was like $2 a piece. I was like, well, we got them for recipes. We got a bunch of these for soups because the girls like those, the Asian chop. I got some sweet potatoes. I got this Miracle Whip. We got this we thought we'd do with our Chinese orange. Got some blueberries and some spinach. And then we picked up some lemonade to do with for our slushies, or for our pelicans. No one else, okay. And then the discount store, I picked up some more chicken lunch meat. I got breakfast sausage here for my egg roll in a bowl. Big thing of potatoes, I think it was $6 for 20 pounds. Here's the meat, I like the meat. This is gonna be for fajitas, so I got one package for each week so we can cook that with chicken and refried beans. And I just need one package of ground beef, I only need five pounds this month, so I got that. What's in the bottom? And, oh, a roast. I was like, what is that? It's a um, London broil for another recipe. We got, these were three for a dollar. These are the greatest tortillas and the kids love them. So I got, we'll use them, they won't go to waste. I got some green apples, some galas, these were on sale. This is, um, I got this, they had, these are at the discount store as well. They were two for a dollar, but I did get guacamole. We got this at Aldi, we're mixing the two stores, groceries. Aldi, 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 this was the discount store. Aldi, this was the discount store. We got these, kids are gonna love these. Chicken and cheese taquitos, kids. The monster ones. They're so excited, spicy. So those are for special yummies. Got a squash here to use. Greg got some grapefruit. Greg got this at Walmart. It's in the wrong table. This is Sam's Club. They got this. It was $1.68 a pound. So we got two of these to make. Red potatoes, a big giant thing of onions, 
cheddar cheese in a can because it's good. This is only $6, so I got this. This was cheaper than buying the avocados. And then um, broccoli, we got the Southwest salad kit because that would be good. And we got the Asian chop salad kit just to have because we like them. Carrots, celery, mushrooms, chop salad, this one. Um, this was on clearance. I told you the price in the store. I don't remember what it was now, but it was a good deal. So I'm going to use this for um, Janita's Warfields, her rice that we make. So this is really good. I got 16 packs of those. Trash bags were out of six bananas. This was on clearance. Oh, no, this wasn't. This is elbow macaroni. We needed that because I don't have any more, so I just got some. This was on clearance, like a dollar a pack. So I thought Lauren and I would eat that. I know we would. And salsa. So this is it. This is all the groceries for the month. And our pantries and freezers still have stuff in them. Like, freezer still has stuff in it. Pantry still has stuff in it. Let me show you here. Pantry still has plenty of stuff in it that we can use up. So they're still here. I have a freezer downstairs with applesauce and a lot of our meats. This cupboard is still full of a lot of stuff. So we have plenty of food to use up this month and use while we're gathering our fragments. So we're going to pull these groceries away and then I'm going to do a little bit of food prep for the month. Okay, the kids can come over here in my pantry because it's loud. I can do this, right? I can come in my pantry where it's a little bit quiet. Ready? There we go. All right, I'm going to talk in my pantry because the kids are playing games out in the living room. So, got my hair in a ponytail. I'm ready to do some food prep. So, what I'm going to do, this is how they're going to be loud. This is how I'm going to make my life a little bit easier. You don't have to do huge food prep, but I am. So, what I'm going to do, I'll put what I make at the bottom of the screen just so it's easier and I'll just kind of mute through this part. Maybe I'll talk. It depends on how loud they are. So first things first, they're gonna have salad tonight so I'm gonna make some hard boiled eggs. So I'll put some of those in the pressure cooker and then I think I'm gonna start cooking my chicken because I wanna shred it and add spices to it, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna put it through the pressure cooker one time and then I'll probably open it back up and then add the spices to it and the veggies to make it taste good and then put it through again so it's nice and tender. So I'll let you know what I'm doing now. So we're gonna go do food prep.
Okay, I have four meals of this, and I'm gonna be cooking this. We're gonna grill it or the pressure cooker, and then serve it with marinara sauce and the salantani pasta. So basically, it'd be like chicken. What's it called? Like Parmesan chicken. So I'm put these in the freezer. We're done. If you just did one thing for food prep, I would just cook your meat. That saves a whole lot of time. So I just put it with onion in here and let it cook. Now that I have a pressure cooker open, what I'm gonna do is put my um, London broil in here, mix up some onions, I've got some garlic, I've got a little bit of celery seed, garlic pepper seasoning, and a little bit of beef um, bouillon in there, so just to help flavor it. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna do is mix up my uh, mixture for my Juanita's um, yellow rice. Basically, I'm gonna put in the bag hers is black beans, corn, tomatoes, diced tomatoes, and green chilies. And then when I go to cook it, and then I'll add the chicken when it's done, but cooking, the cooking, cooking's still cooking. Chicken's still cooking, so I'll add that when it's done. So then, and then the rice I'll add when I make it, so that'll freeze. And then I'm gonna mix up a mixture for jambalaya, which is cut up the sausage, and the chickens will go in there well as well, and I'll add some. Um, do I have chilies in that? Pepper. Chilies and some peppers and onions, and that'll be good. So I'm gonna mix those two up in the bags just while the chicken's cooking. I've been dreaming so much lately about your face when you're smiling. It's the only thing that saves me. Hey, I don't know if I told you that I think you're beautiful and how oh, I can't wait to hold you. Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down and I don't know what I would do without you. Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down. Hey, now look into my eyes. You can use them as a mirror. This is something that I know for sure. It's just something about you. I That's my hamburger. It's all cooked with um, onion and seasoned, and I'm gonna put that in the freezer. That's for chili. We have that. So still waiting on the chicken. I'm gonna start cutting up the. Um, I mixed up the ingredients for my rice for Juanita. I'm just putting Juanita. Juanita. It's not Juanita. Juanita. And then I'm just gonna cut up the sausage right now while I'm waiting on the chicken. One more. Tell me what you wanna do right now. Tell me what you want to do tonight I really don't care as long as I'm with you Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise
into my eyes. Okay, so this is my version of jambalaya. Not everybody else's, <laughs> just mine. So I put in here the sausage, and then I'm gonna put chicken in here, and then I put um, onions chopped up. I had frozen peppers. We are not, I have some, I bought them for fajitas a long time ago, and we like the fresh peppers because we like them crisp. These will be good to put in here. So I just chopped some of the frozen ones up, put them in here, put some tomato, diced tomatoes in there, some Cajun seasoning, a little bit of garlic pepper. My mom gave me this, so this tastes good for salt instead of adding chicken bouillon. And then um, I'm gonna add the chicken when it's done, and then I'll just add rice and all this one pressure cooker. So another one finished. <laughs> Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise Hey, now everything's alright We've been longing for each other And it feels like I'm on cloud nine Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling Okay, you saw my chicken, turned out delicious. I revisited, I've been getting a lot of comments lately from my big giant freezer meals day that I made and I added a lot of this stuff because I had gotten this right up there. This is so good. I think this is like a hidden belly seasoning for like dressing, but it's got like spices that smell so good. There is like paprika and garlic and onion and it's really good. So I added that to my chicken flavor because it's so delicious. So what I ended up doing, I had a block of shredded chicken in the freezer. I'm revisiting it back into the chicken broth there so I can kind of cook again and give it a little bit more flavor because it's been in the freezer for a while just to bring it back to life. So now I'm going to take this chicken and put it in my bags here and I'm almost going to be finishing up. All right, so food is coming along. The girls are like, can we start making dinner? So I am just cooking the rest of this chicken in here with that chicken broth that tastes really good. I added a couple scoops into the meals. So I think I'm finished pretty well. I still, I'm just waiting for the meat to finish. So the um, yellow rice, that's all done. So all I gotta do is put that in the pressure cooker with some rice and some liquid. The jambalaya, same thing, add the rice. Those are done, that's four meals done. Chicken pot pie, that was finished. I put the chicken, the stuffing on top. They liked that last time. And then um, that'll be two meals. And then we're gonna do a broccoli, chicken and rice. Normally I just would've put the chicken in the um, freezer, but I threw the bag of broccoli in there. Distinguish that it's broccoli, chicken, and rice. And then put a little bit of the chicken um, broth from here in there. So that's done. The only, I didn't make Jared's casserole, because that's easy to throw together. There's two of those fajitas will be simple to do together. The fried rice, I'm just gonna, this beef that I'm cooking over here, I'm gonna shred it and put it into a bag and I'm just gonna add it along with some bacon here and then I'm also gonna even shred some of this chicken up and save it. And then that chicken is marinated already and then I just put saved bits of meat for soup. So like our potato soup, we have bacon for that. The other ones are all like sausage. I have chicken noodle, which I'll save some of this chicken. So that's it, finished, which is good. So all I'm gonna end up doing is wait for this to kind of cook here in the sauce, put it in a bag. Same thing with the meat, so. Awesome day.
here's all the dinners along with the ones in the freezer. The girls are making salads and noodles and everything delicious. Okay, I'm gonna go step outside. All right, I came outside because it is hot and sweaty. <laughs> all that food in there, so. What a great day, what a fantastic day. I'm like, this is gonna be so good. I'm excited. We got shopping done. We got our freezer meal prep done for the month, which is nice. Now, like I said, I'm still gonna have to do prep during the week, but not like, like the key is like, you could do it all in one day and be done and then have to do nothing. But I'm choosing this month to do a little bit different. So I'm just gonna do some. And then on Mondays, pretty much Mondays gonna be my day to get all my food together. So if you wanna know how I prepare these meals, watch Mondays because Monday I'll be pulling my meals out for the week getting them in the fridge and then every day I'll be making a meal so that is gonna be great and now I'm gonna let that stuff cool a little bit I'm still waiting on the the beef and the oh hi kitty come see Chee Chee. yep she's a little girl she loves hello she's like I gotta see you so I'm gonna um, now work on this video a little bit since I stop more and the kids are playing they're playing ticket to ride I'm like I just feel like kitchen kitchen grease which, which is good so now I'm gonna sit I'm gonna work on this video for a little bit and get finished and then maybe fill in my new planner I'm excited for that so you guys have a fantastic rest of your day yes yeah, so I was thinking today is Friday so a fantastic rest of your day a great weekend and then I'm gonna see you again tomorrow for abundantly blessed and then on Monday so all right we'll see you later have a great day bye-bye yes hello 